Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's me Video Game Madness. We are here with another GTA 5 playthrough. Today we are doing the Merryweather heist. So this in my opinion I think it's one of the worst heists you know in the game in the entire playthrough. You guys will probably find out, you know, why. I missed you. Hello, Wade. I missed you too. Hello, Trevor. Oh, there. Hey, Hot Lips, where you been hiding? No, 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 nowhere. I got a, a knot the size of a baseball in here, all right? Needs a little, uh, loosening up, all right? Oh. Massage me, motherfucker! Good, good. What the heck? Oh. Trevor's hard at work, huh? Uh. Where's the surrogate child? Who? Not the boy! With the stars in his eyes. Not like that. What's not like that? Oh, hey! Hey there, uh, You and him, the old father-son issues? Gives me the fucking creeps. How's the leg rub? Oh, it's excellent! Fuck, you wanna go? No, I'm good, though. Hey, I, I called you boys here to discuss this job that I've been planning. What the fuck are you talking about? Shut the fuck up, Michael, all right? You owe me. Hey, did you talk to Lester? I called him. He's in the hospital or something, all right? We keep him out and we get 20%. Well, unless, of course, you go states again and uh, have me arrested. Hey, wasn't like that. Better not have been. You know, like, you give a fuck. Oh, see, I give a fuck, Michael. It's a position, a fucking viewpoint, all right? Like God, like evolution, like anything else. Sunshine, boredom, lies, that's what we got. Other people, they have other worlds, but for me, <laughs> I'm like a vulture just circling the desert looking for fucking corpses, you know, a carrion eating motherfucker. Do you understand that? Wow. Woo! Bravo, you fucking idiot. Man, I still don't get the score. What's the fucking plan? We got Floyd! All right? Now, Floyd's got not the fuck! Get out of here! All right? Now, Floyd here works with the port. He puts me on the Merryweather security. Who were running some tests out at sea for Uncle Sam. We're gonna take whatever it is they're testing. Now, got a couple buyers lined up. I guarantee no problems, no major heat. Mm, let's get going, all right? Got a slightly past dead vibe to an airfield where I got a sub, got a chopper, I got everything we need. All right, let's do this, you fuck! Alright, here we go. Now, to re remind you guys, I went with the second option instead of the first one. Um, mostly because I like the second one better, because you have dialogue between all the characters. I mean, the bad side to it is the long drive, which can be boring, but the um, conversation between the three characters is what I think what makes this second but this is the first uh, time I've seen it way of the mission a little bit better. The city for the so let's uh, listen in. Man, it's not like that. Well, what is it like? Huh? You think the world owes you a living? You want money and respect, but you won't cross the street to get it. That useless millennial shit is more of a middle class thing. Where I'm from, hustling is still hustling. And going halfway across yeah. the state is still uh going halfway across the state yeah well sandy shores is the global headquarters for tp inc okay so we gotta make the trip tp inc trevor phillips industries my company industries or incorporated if it's tp inc it'd be trevor <laughs> phillips incorporated just saying you're mocking me <laughs> nice is it so strange that I've made a success of my life? I know that wasn't what you wanted for me when you ran off, but still. Trevor! It's a business, Michael. An honest American business, and there aren't... ...can business, and there aren't many of them left. Hey, you know this airstrip we're going to, we're managing it. Yeah, I hate to think what you did to the last managers. The lost MC LLP experienced an unexpected downturn. Yeah. We had to step in. The lost motorcycle club. <laughs> yeah. You're a serious businessman, T. <laughs> I cannot believe this. The hard-working entrepreneur is getting shit from a guy so lazy he retired in his 30s. 
And then from this other guy, whose sense of entitlement is so strong, he asks how far we had to travel when he's offered a job he ain't even qualified to do. This is why the country is screwed. There's not enough me's, there's too many you's. Yeah, a country full of you's. That's just a country what full this of troubles. <laughs> Shit would get done. Want that sound, you know, shivers winning. down your spine. Hey, look, dude. We you out. Oh my. But if you think you'd be better off on your own, Talk about living no, 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 nightmare. Tell me. Just let's calm down, all right? We have a score to take. There is profit to be made. I mean, don't that beat getting picked up by G-Men and forced to work for free? Yeah, 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 all right. Talk us through exactly what's going on. We're going out to Sandy Shores. I know yeah. that part. My guys will meet us there. They'll have the submarine. I'm gonna get into said submarine that... Wait, hold on. You had the flying lessons, right? Hey, I came prepared. I didn't know what I was preparing for, but I'm feeling pretty confident in the air. Good, 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 good. Hey, what's the next part of the plane? There's an army chopper at the airfield. You're both getting into it. Michael's flying. Gonna take off, pick up the submarine with me in it, and flying out to a point off the coast. You're gonna drop me into the ocean. I'll pilot the sub down to find the device the government's been testing. I'll get it, surface, and you'll fly me back to the airfield. What kind of device? What kind doesn't matter how much we'll be paid for you it. You can see that Michael and uh, are Franklin are kind of skeptical arrive. about this I job. Said at the condo, the tests are being run by Meriwether Security Consulting. Ah, yes, the mercenaries. Fresh from fighting our secret oil wars. Honestly, you can't blame them. If stealing a prototype like this from the government was relaxing, then everyone would be doing it. As it stands, we've got an opportunity to mint some serious coin. Oh, 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 oh. there's easier ways. Yeah, it does. extreme, T. Even for you. <sighs> can't we rethink? I mean, how deep are you into it? How deep? I've got a sub. I've got a big helicopter. I've been researching Let's listen this to the rest of this real LS. quick. Those guys, Wade and his cousin Floyd, are expecting a paycheck. Same with my intel guy, Ron Jakowski. Just so you guys can hear the rest of the dialogue without Lester, I might add. me okay. cutting it off. Fine, fine, I'll go along with it. Listen, Frank, if you want out, I understand. No, 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 I'm good. I can do it with a paycheck. That's the spirit! Alright. There we go. And here's my submarine! Floyd, wait! Stand by the hangar. This is our chopper, I guess. Alright, let's get into the cargo bob. Now, I really don't like this plane. Um, I didn't even like it in the classic GTA games because I always struggled with getting the vehicle or whatever onto the hook. And, um, like, Honestly, I'm a decent flyer, you know, I can do things no problemo, but the Cargo Bob has never been very, uh, good for me. But, on the same note, another plane that was not good for me, or aerial vehicle, was the Hydra. Now, I've never really liked the Hydra because of, um, the, uh, problems with it, mostly because of the nightmares I still have from the uh, mission from GTA San Andreas, um, interdiction, or vert- no, it was like vertical something, vertical bird, that was the mission. That mission gave me so much nightmares and so much, uh, anger. But, you know, even that, I still hate, you know, the Hydra. Especially, you know, with GT Online, because they made Hydra like this, um, huge griefing plane. Now, I heard, like, with this update, they kind of toned it down a little bit, as well as, you know, the, um, that big weapon thing in the facility, um, what the hell is it called? I can't think of it, but, um, it was like this huge missile thing that could blow you up in an instant. 
For some reason, I can't remember it all that well, um, because I never really got it. But it's good that, you know, Rockstar toned down some of that stuff, which, honestly, they should have done a long time ago, but, you know, I guess late is better than never, if you think about it. But, yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's get ready to take this thing underwater. Here we go. Now, like I said, I hate this submarine, but... Honestly, I think this mission is better than the first mission to this of the heist. Because you could either choose to do where you hijack the uh, ship or you just do this and to me I think hijacking the ship is a lot more harder a lot more complicated so in my mind with this I think it's like a little bit easier a little bit more simple um, and one of the things that I have to work with is like my controller because I have a stick drift problem with it so me trying to do some of the things that I was able to do a few months ago, I can't really do with the controller. Because of how janky and how um, bad it's getting. Here we go. <laughs> we should be getting close to it. Yeah. Now it should be all the way down at the bottom of the the ocean. Now during store mode you can actually find uh, money caches and when you find those you get these certain amount of money that you can use for stocks or uh, whatever. Alright, got it. Oof. Hey man, so uh, got the thing. What is it? We'll know what it is when we can run some tests. Yeah. Well, what, it look like? what you think it is? Uh, best guess it was hooked into the rock, maybe on a fault line, so could be a seismic suppressor to combat earthquakes and tsunamis, or no, potentially it's like a fusion reactor running on seawater. Like nuclear. Uh. Yeah, in other words, that's like a nuclear... I think it's a nuclear warhead. Don't uh, quote me on that, but, you know, by looking at the uh, missile stuff that was down there, it looks like it could possibly have been a um, nuclear warhead. Now, what Trevor's trying to do is... Basically, he's trying to do this heist to help his business but by doing that he's also trying to give so like the warhead off to uh... chinese see if he can possibly i don't know for sure but try and make things right between uh... chang jr and the rest of the uh... triads but, you know, when we get done with this mission, there will be some stuff that we will finish up figuring out. Alright, here we go. Now, let's see if I remember this. Okay, shoot down the boats. There we go. Good. Go over here to this side, take these guys down. Got one. Oh. Where are we at? Oh. Gotta take him down. Got him. Okay. Get that guy over there, I think. Just gotta shoot him down. 
I hope that, you know, we don't fail this mission, because I want to pass this, you know, first try right out the gate. There we go, we got him. I think we're good on this side, so... Oh. No, we're not done yet. Alright. Let's fire. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Let's take him down. Now let's take get this helicopter before we get shot down. Oh. And I thought I got the helicopter. Guess not. There we go. Let's get to the airstrip. What was that, T? I told you! That was Merriweather! Those choppers? And I didn't know my private security guards! Yeah, you're right! I have it on good authority that they're actually a lizard army who've taken human form to do the bidding of the New World Order. I hope you can flip this thing fast, and I don't want to see those reptile buddies of yours ever again. <laughs> Alright. We're getting closer to the uh, airstrip. Mm. But, you know, like I said, cannot stand this heist uh, mission. I think there's a lot of people that agree with me on that, that this is one of the worst heist missions in the entire storyline. There we go. We got it. first try. Do you know what you've done? The fire is going fucking crazy. Oh, and good to see you too. What's it been? Not ten years? After this, the government won't care how long it's been. They're gonna put you and everyone you ever knew on their kill list. And you! I thought you would be smarter than this. What'd I do? Stealing a super weapon to sell to the Chinese. Damn, T. This some nuke or some shit? I thought you said you spoke to him. Yeah, I did. Okay? Kind of. I mean, he was all woozy and shit. It doesn't matter, all right? It's done. We've got See, it. Trevor lied about Back. telling Lester. See, by the time they get a salvage operation together. No! Oh, so you want a drone circling your trailer? We'll get you another score, Trevor. You own me! Wait, get in that chopper! Listen to whatever this fucking moron has to say! Okay! Alright, on that note, I'm out of here. You won't be seeing me back here in a long time. Hey! We need a score! Remember! Man, I thought I was done not getting paid for these licks. Hello! Me too! You can see his frustration there. I had deranged, you know, Trevor really is right there. I mean, that's got hurt, just slamming your face to a wall like that. Ouch. But, yeah, we got nothing for this heist. And it's one of the worst. But I will see you all back when we get a phone call. Brother O'Neill. Fuck you, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're the guy stealing contracts. You burnt a farm, killed my brothers. You had too many brothers. They needed calling. You're fucking dead. Aren't we all? We live and we die. That's our curse. Hey, you want to expedite the situation? Come fucking find me. <laughs> Vespucci Beach, Los Santos, you inbred hillbilly fuck. I'll be there, man. I don't know when, but I'll be there. <laughs> Alrighty then. Okay, so we'll do this random encounter mission, and then after that we'll call it good. So we can start off the Bureau missions nice and uh, fresh. Will you two just make out already? Hey, can you give me a ride just so Boy Scout there can get his Buzzkill badge? Here, let's take the dude home.
Man, this dude's super drunk. Alright, you can take him to the altruist camp. I'm on Alta hmm. Place. Up, Very tempting. Uh, Ave. We'll probably do that when we get closer because that's like oh, a so super far radius. Like all the way out in uh, Blaine County. Take it slow. Hey, thanks for this, man. As you can see, I could have driven. No. Are you fucking wasted or something? No problem, but Joy Killer back there had to lay a guilt trip on me. You believe he wanted me to walk? Walk? I don't know you think this is Europe. It's because mm. I sound drunk. Doesn't mean my brain's. What oh, the I'm so fuck, sorry. dude? Yeah, I'm a crazy driver. I can't help it. Drunk. Doesn't mean my brain's drunk. You know, it's offensive. You don't call a deaf kid stupid for talking funny. I can't believe he just walked out without me. Why did guys turn into such? Whoa! Oh! oh shit! Ah, uh, gonna... oh, dude, not in the car. Like, if you're oh, gonna do it, it, do it someplace man. else. Nobody wants to see do puke. Like, ugh. Nauseating. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, most of it went out the window. Uh, uh. Alright. Oh. I don't know. At least, let's see how far it would I'll be from here. Just to double way. check. I promise uh, you're not as interesting as you think you yeah, are. Yeah, I don't think so. Fair okay. Enough. I feel much better. That tactical vomit really sorted me out. Sorted yeah, me dude, now. get oh, help. Yes! I still got some clock and bell at home from last night. Ugh. Ugh. Order that! Thanks for the ride, man. Sorry for blowing chunks. Take this toward the cleaning. I'll see you around. Try not to pass out and try Alright, if you guys like this video, make sure to give a like, subscribe, turn bell notifications. And if you want to help support me here on the channel, go check out my Patreon page. And I will see you on the next video. See ya.